That was a what? Hey folks, this is Tanya, and thanks for joining me in my new series. That was a what? So walk with me as I take an item and deconstruct it and try to find another amazing use for that item. So we have the pillowcase. And I purchased satin so that I could do a, a lining and uh, have it completely finished on the inside. This is a view of the sleeve where I had folded the pattern in half along the finished edge of that pillow cover. I opened it here to show you how much wider the pattern was versus the actual pillow covers. I also wanted to show you a mistake I made. See the triangle there? Do not cut that out. Leave that whole piece, that whole pattern piece solid. I accidentally cut that. It's been a minute since I actually sewed from a pattern. So that is the dart, you will need that. So what I'm showing you here is just another visual of the sleeve. I believe this is the front panel. And so what I'm showing you here is just cutting those uh, notches so that when you do match your seams, you'll be able to match your uh, triangles, those little notches there. This is the, the back, I folded it in half. This is the inside of that pillow cover, which is very furry and nice and soft. This is the sleeve where I connected the elasticized wrist. And I did the same for the waistband. This is the jacket. I created this masterpiece, as I said, from two patterns. One was a simplicity pattern and one was a McCall's pattern. I'll put that information in the, uh, in the info. It, when you get done watching the video, you'll be able to see it. I added a hood and the jacket is fully lined. So what had happened was, see, I forgot to put the pocket in and I'm not big on sewing and then taking my seam ripper and breaking seams apart. So I decided to sew the pocket into the satin lining and it's almost like a safety feature by having the pocket on the inside. So I have a couple projects planned. I have some denim. I have several pair of Dickies jeans I want to make something out of. I have a, my first leather coat that I ever purchased on my own. Um, the leather is bad, so I really want to make uh, something out of that. I have a couple of really cool heirloom pieces that were my grandfather's. Um, my grandfather on both sides of the family. So I'm really looking forward to doing something special with those pieces. So don't forget to like, subscribe, share. If you like this video, give me the thumbs up. And um, we'll see you soon. Peace.